okay. So when I saw this headline in the press a couple of days ago, it made me worry and it inspired me to make my own emergency podcast quite late on a Thursday evening just for the end of term. So forgive the low production values here, but you do. You do indeed. Now at school, our children know how to keep themselves safe. We have, we have rules and we have our own policies and procedures to do that. But you need to too. There's a heck of a lot out there that we need to protect our children from and educate them to be safe. And actually, if there is grooming going on, it's more likely to be someone that they know and rather than being bullied online, I do believe that statistically, the chances are that children are more likely to do the bullying. So there's a whole range of stuff there that's, that, that we've got to teach our infant children to understand and to be aware of for later life. And that actually isn't the answer. It's more about you and how you're open with your child and how you facilitate this. Filters do have their place, but so do restrictions. Time frames, pages not to go on, rules about what to do if something you see something that's not right. That open dialogue about what to do when you do see something that's not right. And the certainty of the children knowing that you're going to be checking regularly. The boundary is important too. Children, little children shouldn't be going on um, iPads, technologies, open, endless, open endless, endlessly. The restrictions need to be in place and time frames too. And I say you should adopt the rules that we have sent you, which are very similar to the rules that we have in school. Have a look at them. They're online. And these are non-negotiable. Non-negotiable. And it's about you modelling the correct behaviours. Children, my, you know, my dad used to say to me, you know, if something happens, we've got we to gotta talk about it. And that's something that stayed with me throughout my life. Children need to be should feel able and empowered to come and talk to you if something's happened that's not right. It's not about iPads, it's about really, it's about good parenting and that important connection that you have with your children. And that's why my staff sign up to an acceptable use um, agreement and that's why I want you to sign up to this acceptable use agreement form two just telling me just committing to these principles and boundaries and these behaviors and these rules to protect our children for later life at school if something goes wrong they know what to do to sort it out you need to make sure that your child needs to know what to do if they encounter something online at home and how to sort that out which inevitably results in talking to you plus you double checking to make sure everything's fine so end of term a little bit a little bit um, amateurish my podcast but i hope you, i hope you'll help me with these mess important messages